Good morning, 47. The board has sanctioned Eric Soders for termination. After Colorado, we did some digging into Soda's private affairs and discovered that he has been fast-tracked for critical heart surgery at the hyper-exclusive Gama Private Hospital in Hokkaido, Japan. Such a display of power has Providence written all over it. Soda's, who suffers from a rare condition known as situs inversus, where his internal organs are reversed, desperately needs a right-sided heart transplant and has clearly betrayed the ICA to get it. He was admitted last night and is currently being prepped for a three-day surgery. We have booked you into Gama under the usual guise of Tobias Reaper, corporate shark, here for a standard medical checkup. As such, you will need to play it by ear and procure whatever tools you need to complete the mission. You also need to eliminate Yuki Yamazaki, a Tokyo lawyer who works for Providence. Sodas has already given Yamazaki access to our client records and has agreed to provide a full list of active ICA operatives post-operation. This transaction cannot be allowed to happen. Sodas must pay for his treachery and his insidious employers must be taught a lesson. ICA's sovereignty is at stake. Powerful as Providence may be, we need to draw a line in the sand. I will leave you to prepare. Welcome to Hokkaido 47. The Gama Private Hospital provides cutting-edge medical treatment for the global elite outside the law if required. The facility is partially run by an artificial intelligence system known as Kai. The AI oversees patient admission to various areas in the hospital and even participates in some medical procedures. You will find Eric Soders in the operating theater undergoing a pre-surgery regenerative stem cell treatment, a highly controversial procedure yet to be approved by Japanese authorities. Yuki Yamazaki has already arrived. You'll find her in her suite or roaming the restaurant and spa areas of the hospital. Sodas is scheduled to be put under soon. Let us make sure he stays that way. Good luck, 47. like this. Good luck. Uh. Yuki Yamazaki dropped her cigarettes off the lift when arriving at the hospital. According to her bodyguards, this has put her on edge. Maybe you can help quench those cravings, 47. Cigarettes are contraband at Gamma, but surely not everyone follows the rules. So the client's a trial lawyer? Criminal defense. Yamazaki takes all the controversial
Are you nuts? No patience in here. Go back to bed. What a relief, Mr. Dexter, that you're still breathing. Um, this machine seems to be on the blink. Let me just... There we go. Okay, you can go. Thank you. Well, since we're here, let's take a look. That's good, good. Oh. Boy, as long as they're just completely off the tracks. Mr. Jason Portman. Mr. Dexter, I'd quit smoking. Please come yesterday. to the hospital entrance. A doctor will escort you to your checkup. That was for Mr. Jason Portman. A doctor will escort you to your appointment. Please proceed to the hospital entrance.
Sorry, this area is restricted at the moment. You can just go back the same way you came in. Come on. I don't care. Unbelievable. Uh, just unbelievable. Potentially the biggest of the day. That's fine. isn't it? A total ban? I don't know. The patient did die. A famous one at that. Still, it's not the chef's fault. What was the kitchen apprentice thinking, cutting out a fugu fish by himself unsupervised? I mean, it takes years of practice. Didn't the kid realize how poisonous those things are? <laughs> He's a kid. I mean, probably wanted to show off. I don't know. But anyway, the hospital administration probably thought it would be better to just ban serving fugu altogether. Poor chef. That was his best party trick. Now what do we do with the last fugu? Uh, throw it out, I guess. <laughs> it's a damn shame, too. Chef had a review serving me. I think it's your turn to clean the drains and the shower. None of you service staff through here. Yeah, yeah, no crying. Just Yamazaki. Oh, oh fuck. Fuck. you're done. Up, chest out. You know, even with the added security, this is the most relaxing gig I've been on with Miss Yamazaki yet. Mm. Makes me miss the old days, to be honest. Oh, cool. Not me. I'm pretty happy she got out of the candle. Oh, sure. The work was done. Oh, come on! What? Give 
me a break. Fancy get up. Nicely done, 47. When Yamazaki finds that pack, she's sure to want to light up in the first place she can find.
That is Yuki Yamazaki, former lawyer to the Yakuza and current operative for Providence. Target down. Now it's time for soldiers to retire. I'm so sorry. Not even the guards can walk through here now. So please go back.
curator's research aid, right? Let me guess. You want to know about a medical file? Oh, so it is true. The, the guys had a mood-altering neurochip implanted in his brain. So, so how does it work? Uh, does it work? Sorry, I just have to wait for my research paper. I'm following the trial closely, and with a little luck, he'll be the basis for my doctorate. All I can say is that I've got a very interesting bit of insight into his mental state. Fine, fine, I'll just have Dr. To... Katashi Ito, also known as the curator, is participating in some sort of medical trial. Interesting. The curator oversees the hospital's organ storage facility and surely has access to Soda's donor heart. I suggest you locate the research assistance report, 47, and find out what this neural implant is for. Could prove useful. Ask you again when we're drunk. Clear in your end? Good. working through the night a few days ago. This is my dream job. To be here as a student is a lifelong fantasy come true. I, I, I will do everything I can to excel every single... Oh, my. This place. The colors. Oh, all the shapes. It's beautiful. Exactly as it needs to be. Oh, a place for everything and everything in its proper place. Oh my goodness. But why haven't I noticed before? I need to share this with my babies. You are excused. That is the right-sided donor heart destined for sodas. This is what he sold out the ICA for. Bringing joy to the world now, 47. Well, let's see where this takes what are you, him, shall up to, we? Man? What's going on here? Hey, hold it right there. Well, I 
I don't know what I mean. But from a medical perspective, one would obviously like the younger donors, especially donors who bother so I'm not a fucking maintenance worker here. be a clear message to anyone considering following in his footsteps. That's both targets down. Time to find an exit. We're done here. I got so hammered last time. I'm fine. That's not what my ticket says. We received your message. Loud and clear, I might add. Honestly, you could have just sacked the poor guy. I didn't catch your name. No, you didn't. There'll be no retaliation. Not for Soders, nor any other recent fiascos. Someone's been meddling in our affairs. Killing our operatives. And making the ICA look like fools. I think you got close to that someone. Closer than we've ever been. That's why we're hiring you to take him down. I don't think so. Don't rattle our cages, Miss Burnwood. You really have no idea. You spy on us, bribe our people, and you have the gall to demand our help. No. You can't be trusted. Even so, we've been around for a long, long time. I think we could help each other. Some 20 years ago, your agency took in a young man with no past and extraordinary skills. 
in his own special way, he cares about you, and vice versa. And ever since that time, you've never stopped wondering where he came from and who made him what he is. There was a doctor, some depraved experiment, but he's gone now. Ah. Well, if you believe the questions died with him, we have nothing further to discuss. If not, as I said, I think we could help each other. Partners, then. Cheer up, Miss Burnwood. We... <laughs> we are the lesser evil. This terrorist. He wants nothing but chaos. He's only a terrorist if you win. Miss Burnwood, we won a long time ago. This, <laughs> this is maintenance. <laughs> 